Hi, we just finished meeting for intonation practice on Wednesday, December 6th, and um, I cut it kind of short today, but we got to practice. That's what, and we got to practice, and that's what's important. <laughs> that's what's important. You can say important, it's not wrong, but it's more common to make it shorter and important, make the in as its own syllable. That's what's important. What do you want to hear? So it might look like, what do you want to hear? And if we were spelling it the traditional way to represent casual English, it would be spelled what do you want to hear? But it really sounds like what do you want to hear? <laughs> All of these vowels change to a, uh, and here stays the real word here. Can't change that. But what do you want to hear? What do you want to hear? Da, 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 da. It could be anything. What do you want to do? What do you want to watch? What do you want to eat? <laughs> and what would you like to drink? Would you, the D and the Y, always make a J together? And you can connect this and say, would you, and keep the U, or would J, and change it to a. Uh. So, what would you like to drink? What would J like to drink? And I'm going to put that little mark by that K too, because you don't hear any of these um, stop consonants. What, hold the T, what, would, hold the D, like, hold the K, drink, hold the N, there. What would you like to drink? Look at the big picture. Look at, will connect, at the, I'm making my T for at in the position for the TH, and I'm stopping the airflow at the, and then releasing it for the the. Look at the big picture, and you don't hear the T and at, you don't hear the G in big, you don't hear the K in pick. Um, look at the big picture. <laughs> it's important to look at the big picture. It's important. To look at the big picture. It's important to look at the big picture. The plan has the virtue of simplicity. The plan has the virtue of simplicity. Anything that ends in ity is a d or idi. Mouth watering neats. So mouth watering instead of the ing ing in the back like sing. I'm changing it to in with the tongue in the front for the in, and then that will connect to the eats. Mouth watering neats. Um, this is just an example. The D and the Y make a J, and the U changing to a. Uh. So did you? Sounds like did ya? Did you know that? <laughs> uh, that's it. Uh, for those of you that were here, thank you for letting me cut it a little short today, and I had fun. I hope to see you next Wednesday. Have a good weekend.